So this is Christopher from Jennifer and you're watching Alex Jovem. Thank you very much. What's it like uh, for you guys being in Portugal? Um, it's nice. It's our first time here ever. So we haven't seen much, but it seems like a nice place. You guys were formed like in 96, right? Like a long time ago. I read that. Actually. Uh, not, not this band, but our first band. Three of the members have played since 95. Uh -huh. But this very band was formed in 2000. Uh -huh. But this lineup of the band has been around since 2003, when he joined okay. the band. Do you guys uh, consider yourselves, you know, uh, to r write very often or not so often? We, we r write songs all the time, but it takes, it's a quite slow process for us. I mean, the work on the album was maybe one or two years. Yeah, no, it was one year of, of for ten songs. So the album and, and the first, the, the B side on the first single. Do, uh, you know, if you could call it, if you, if you want to go with genres, post-rock. Do you think the, the, the Swedish landscape inspires you to play post-rock music or something? There are more like uh, that kind of landscapes in this area of yeah. Europe, uh, I mean compared to where we're from. Uh, the, the part of Sweden where we're from is very, very flat and it's not, I mean we live in a city so we don't live in, in the in the forest or in no, the mountains. <laughs> It, it is, I mean, it's a nice landscape, but I think, I mean, to us it's nicer to be in Portugal. <laughs> it's probably, um, probably other things more than the landscapes. Yeah. We don't really consider us, ourselves playing post-rock anymore. Of course it's a good way sometimes to, to get people to understand what sort of, what kind of music it is, but I don't think we, I mean, I don't think we sound like too many of the other bands that are called post-rock. I mean, some of them maybe, but uh, most of them are doing instrumental stuff. And of course, like not, not to pigeonhole you or anything. You know, no, you're no, free no, to no. do everything. The landscape thing is probably what people want us to to to, to like have as a source of inspiration or whatever. But I'm, I mean, it's it's about it'd be too easy. Yeah, I mean, yeah. people want want bands to be in a genre and uh, like if you play this kind of music you know with like soundscapes and a lot of sounds and you know a bit that kind of music people want you to have that kind of like other things around it but I mean we're maybe I mean I don't know maybe some people really get that the strong feeling of it being really kind of landscapey and all that I mean depending on what kind of music you listen to, I don't know. But I, I would say it's more kind, kind of cinematic, even though that's, that's a cliché too, but I think, it's, but I think that, that's, at least that I can agree on a bit more. It's kind of odd because, you know, if you, if you look at, you know, some, you know, again, to, to go with genres, but post-rock bands like, for instance, Tartus, um, they were never really landscape-y, you know. Uh, it's kind of odd, you know, they were much more like angular and uh, architectural, I, I think. Yeah. I think we'd rather be compared to those kind of bands, like Tortoise, yeah. rather than Sigurus or Explosion in the Sky, uh -huh. yeah, I think which we get compared to all the time, really? yeah, for some reason. I but think you're rockier, actually, then. Yeah, so do, so do we think. Uh -huh. To me, you're more of an indie band than yeah, you know. Yeah, we, we have songs. I mean, we have. It's not always verse, chorus, verse, but it's a bit yeah. more like song structures uh -huh. as opposed to all those bands that are kind of doing ten minutes kind of mm -hmm. instrumental pieces. Jennifer Ever, the, the name. Uh, what is it? It's taken from a Smashing Pumpkins song called Jennifer Ever. Oh really? So it's the girl's name Jennifer and the word Ever. And it doesn't mean anything to us, really. Uh, it's just a pretty name. Yeah, uh, we don't even so something don't even like. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we like Smashing Pumpkins, maybe, but it's not that we're huge fans. Of I mean, them it's, or it's been around since we were 16, so uh, that's what we were called, Jennifer. So which album was it actually? I don't remember. Uh, it's a song called Jennifer Ever from their first demo, or yeah. Oh, okay. So it's back in the 80s stuff. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and I, it's, I, a, I, it's I, a horrible song also. So. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> really. Yeah. 